A new state-of-the-art laboratory and research facility is coming to Dallas. As Kennedy Walker shows us, it will allow researchers to get a better understanding of certain diseases, including HIV and tuberculosis. A very exciting day in Dallas after the city broke ground on a new laboratory and research facility. You can see it here right now. It just looks like a pile of dirt, but soon it will be a more than 70,000 square foot building equipped with the best technology and equipment for researchers to tackle the some of the most common diseases. The $52 million facility will be a level three lab, which means that it will be used to study and test infectious diseases that can be spread by contact like HIV. V, hepatitis C, and TB. It will also have the capacity to test for Zika, Ebola, COVID-19, the flu, and more. COVID was a great demonstration of how important uh, this lab work is for us to be able to respond to public health emergencies, and this really gives us uh, the capacity to, to do and handle all the needs that we have, and they keep growing, whether it's opioids, whether it's uh, West Nile virus, whether it's all these different things uh, that we can now uh, have adequate facilities. This project is expected to be completed by 2025. In Dallas, Kennedy Walker, CBS News, Texas.